Hi, David here. I love trading Amazon stock and Amazon options. I also feel the stock is going to split soon and I'm not alone. The truth is no one knows what Jeff Bezos is thinking. There have been countless videos and TV shows on CNBC, on YouTube, on Forbes, on MarketWatch. Everyone is throwing in their opinion about when Amazon will split. But so far, everyone has been wrong. For this reason, I'm going to throw out my opinion today and why I would love to see an Amazon stock split. So Amazon stock is priced near $2,700 per share, making it one of the most expensive stocks in the S&P 500. So why do I believe a stock split is coming? Well, I'm going to bet on the ego of Jeff Bezos and a big milestone coming in the stock market. Here is my prediction. I believe Amazon will continue to rise this year based on its incredible business model and the overwhelming state of the retail apocalypse. The company is going to continue to see expansion as other companies go under and Amazon is right there to fill the void. So what does any of this have to do with Jeff Bezos and an Amazon stock split? Well, back in 2017, when Amazon first hit $1,000 per share, Jeff Bezos said this, we don't have any plans to do this at this point, but we'll continue to look at that. In other words, we are not going to split anytime soon. And keep in mind, stock splits have fallen out of favor over the last 20 years. They have been replaced by the ego and power of a high share price. But that was three years ago, and Amazon is rapidly approaching $3,000 per share, meaning that just 100 shares would cost $300,000. And Jeff Bezos has a new prize on the horizon. No, it's not share price. It's the bragging rights of being the first of his big competitors to hit a $2 trillion market cap. So how is Amazon going to hit a $2 trillion market cap? Well, based on Amazon's 498 million shares and a share price of $4,025 per share, Amazon would hit a $2 trillion market cap. And I have to think this would be a big deal for Amazon and for Jeff Bezos. Here's how I think they get there. We all know that with high flyers like Amazon, Tesla, and Netflix, when they announce a stock split, there is a lot of excitement and the stocks tend to rally before the stock actually splits. I believe if Amazon waits until the share price is closer to 3,500 and then they announce a stock split, I believe the stock will rally 15 to 20%, pushing the stock closer to a $2 trillion market cap. I believe Jeff Bezos is willing to give up some of the share price in order to reach the milestone of a $2 trillion market cap. And remember this, if a stock is trading near $4,000 a share and it does a two for one stock split, it'll still be trading at $2,000 a share, making it a very expensive stock. How do we get to these lofty prices in the first place? Amazon is already trading near $2,700 per share. So a move to $3,500 is just a 29% increase in the stock price. At a time when Amazon's business is firing on all cylinders and they're continuing to take market share from businesses that are going under. And the trend is likely to continue. Amazon has increased $800 a share just this year. Okay, enough about my predictions on Amazon. Now I'm gonna talk about my selfish reasons for why I wanna see Amazon split. As an options trader, I like what I call the volatility straddle. Simply selling a call and selling a put at the same strike price at a price higher than where the stock is currently trading. I like to do this trade when volatility is high. For instance, when the market has fear or after a bad earnings report. This is a great way to take a position in a stock and then make money as the price of the stock goes higher or as volatility drops. And by the way, this can be a risky options trade. So if you're new to options, 
Be careful. I did this trade on Apple a few months ago when everything was dropping. It allowed me to trade it several times and make fast profits. But I avoided this trade with Amazon options simply because of the share price. I don't want that much money tied up in a single trade. So in my dream world, if Amazon were trading at $500 a share, 100 shares would cost 50,000 instead of the almost 300,000 today. Since I do trades that involve hedging with the stock or at least being willing to buy the stock, this would make me very happy. My guess is that Amazon is going a lot higher over the next 10 years as they continue to dominate and take over sectors as they have done in the past. As many of you know, I do a lot of videos on real estate investing. So I think Amazon should buy Zillow and become one of the biggest real estate and mortgage companies. Zillow is a small $12 billion company, mere pocket change for Amazon. But more about this in a future video. If you enjoyed this video, and I hope you did, please subscribe to my YouTube channel at flippingacademy.com. Tell your friends and be sure to check out my podcast, link in the description. I'm doing new videos and podcasts each week on real estate investing, personal finance, and making money. So thanks for watching and have a great day.